Hello to all the hair besties in the land. It is me, your number one hair bestie, Guy Tang. And I'm here with Jenny. Jenny. Ooh, Jennifer, hi. the hot mom. You, you are the hot mom. So your hair is still wet. Yes, I just showered this morning. You just showered? Oh, well, I'm I glad. wanted to be fresh. Well, these are clean. <laughs> So it's been what? Um, how many months? You got about, a little retage. Yes, yeah, about almost two months already since I've been here. So, yeah. So today we're gonna do some neon charcoal fun. Are you excited? Ooh, yes, I love the, neon. The hot mom is back yeah. because you know her. She uh -huh. loves attention. She loves attention. <laughs> <laughs> so the brighter the better, right? Yes, I like bright. Let's go get you some attention. Come on, let's get All right, this going. Jennifer. Okay, we had an interesting conversation. You're talking about like how you love attention yes. and that you always talk about how you love yourself. Yes. But then you're there's people out there that think you're being crazy, right? I think I'm being conceited. <laughs> conceited? Yes. You know what's funny? Because people always preach about you gotta love yourself, love yourself, choose yourself first, blah yes. blah blah blah. And when you do, they say you're selfish, you're yeah, conceited. You're conceited, you're you know, cocky. You should, yeah, you're cocky and everything. And it's not that it's just like you have your confidence your confidence level should go up you should put yourself first before anyone else and that's what, like a lot of people judge me for that because uh, I say that I put myself first before I put my kids and that's because my kids they need me to be good they need me to be happy so I can make them happy they need me to be fit so they could be but you fit. know people are gonna dis <laughs> you know they're gonna disagree with you there's they gonna be do, people yes. out there that's gonna disagree <laughs> no but see the thing is if you're not healthy you can't make your kids healthy right yeah if you if you can't take care of yourself you can't take care of anyone yeah. else no and it's like how can you love someone else if you don't love yourself like you need to love yourself deeply and get to know how you really are and accept yourself before you could be able to accept someone else for who they are before you could show your love to someone else like you know you can be all depressed like I know a lot of moms are depressed because their bodies changed you know mm. uh, the whole pregnancy thing you have to accept what it is and you have to live with it and you have to move on and you have to love yourself for that you know you created kids you created life you, you have, have three kids me. yes you have three kids and one thing I noticed about you is that you're so free-spirited <laughs> and that you know um, and you your kids love your hair yes they love it they love it they want to do the same but there's an age limit where uh, yeah, you're, you're like no you, yes. you set boundaries and rules yes, so you're yes. you're a good mom I am. but then your kids also call you a hot mom a hot mama <laughs> and, and it's okay yes. see you know I, okay. I I feel like people always have judgment on what a good mom should look like or a good mom should, should be. be yeah and should do and should act and it's not you you don't have to be a good mom and follow you know the whole old traditions and stuff you could be a good hot mama and you know Put yourself first. <laughs> yeah, yeah. I, I agree with you, but you know there's gonna be people <laughs> leaving comments down there and, and disagreeing with you. No, I'm but, open to all comments too. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> you know, I, I agree with what you're saying because you're saying it's good to love yourself mm -hmm. first, take care of yourself so you can take care of anyone else. Yes. Your kids, your husband, yes. your family, yes. your friends. Yes. And if you don't love yourself, I wanna find just lots of negativity. Have mm -hmm. you noticed that people who don't love themselves actually start hating yes, everyone they hate a lot and you shouldn't be hating on no one yeah. you know if you don't like someone <laughs> nah, nah, i can't i can't say it because i love everyone you know i can't yeah. i can't I'm because not you you know what you know what it is because you love yourself you yeah. love yourself, that's why you love everyone. Yeah, I can't judge people, you know, because yeah. like, I'm me, you know, I judge myself. And I know I love you! Oh, I love you! I love you so much. Well, I'm smashing the bleach into oh, no, your hair. Right? Let's see what your color looks like. Let's see, let's peel this off. Mm. Oh, Ooh, I think you're about ready. Yes. Are you ready to go um, neon? Yes. Let's get started. Let's do it. <laughs> oh, wait, we gotta show them the world. Let's show them the oh, world. It's a beautiful view, out it's here. A beautiful view yes. up here, guys. Oh, uh, this is actually the Hollywood Hills. Yeah. Uh, here, let's show them. Houses. Let's show them the Hollywood Hills. Ooh. These are like little houses up here, guys. No, they're huge houses. Oh, oh, they're, uh, they look little from here. They're huge. Yeah, here's the hills. <laughs> look at that. Ooh, The Walking Dead. Ooh. Look, these are like huge ass houses on the hills. Yeah. Yes, y'all. That's literally where all the celebrities live. <laughs> I know, look at that huge house right there. Ooh, I'm moving up there. Right? <laughs> Dang, that's gonna be my house. Um, <laughs> I'm not selling it right 
now. Oh, oh, that's where you live. That's where you live. That's so we are done with the pre-lightening. As you can see, this is how high I live Jennifer's hair up to. It's about a level nine. Some parts are ten-ish, but this will be fine. I'm gonna shadow this down and put the neon glow right through here. Are you excited? I'm excited. <laughs> are you ready for extra attention? I'm extra attention ready. Yes. Attention ready? <laughs> All right, guys. So check this out. I got a bit of con concoction here. I mix all these different shades of blues and purples. It's hard to tell on camera, but they look very distinctive. They look pretty. They look yeah, beautiful. there's yeah. some greens and stuff. And this stuff has not come out yet, as you can see. <laughs> <laughs> exclusive. Okay, this stuff is really exclusive, guys. I got a whole bunch of Kenra neon colors. Uh, oh. Oh, <laughs> so I got some new Kenra neon colors. We are in February right now. So uh, by the time I release this, it'll probably be August or somewhere around that time when the Glow collection will come out. So this is the neons and I get to test it. I have a whole box batch of them here. So I got all the colors of charcoal, green, yellow, orange, blue, violet, fuchsia. And it will be available. So what I love to do is test the colors, play with the colors almost like six months, eight months in advance, get to get familiarized with it and get to know the product well enough. So when I share it with you guys, I already know how it performs. So I can't wait till you guys see this video. I'm so excited. <laughs> so that's why I mix up all this fun cocktail of color. And it's all gonna go on your head. Yes. Yes. Special. You're very special. <laughs> Oh my gosh, I'm so excited about that neon green though. It really glows. And then we charcoalize out those ends and get that midsection really bright and glowing. This is gonna be epic. This is so exciting guys. So, so far this is what's going on. I create the shadow right down here on the ends. And then we create that band of light. I want it to look like the northern lights. Um, like an aurora and then I drag some of the shadow down here this is gonna be so much fun all right here we go hey so <laughs> go ahead Jen hold oh my gosh okay Ooh. actually hold with this hand okay <laughs> but yeah okay so this is what's going on in the front um, I'm bringing the green up closer to around her face so here we go <laughs> okay <laughs> So, anyway, so let me tell you guys what, going off of the story that Jennifer was talking about earlier about like her <laughs> having a lot of self-confidence and people think she's cocky or conceited or whatever, and I was telling you, Jennifer, like, I came from a time when I was, you know, growing up my whole life, I was very insecure. I sat at lunch by myself uh, in high school and middle school. I only have a couple friends, and I was really scared to go up and talk, like, in front of the class. You know, yeah. like, I'd rather, <laughs> I almost rather get eaten by a shark than go up in front of the class, you know? Yeah. It took me till up, I was about 27 years old, uh, till I built up my confidence. It's mainly because I didn't know who I was, um, until I find who I was, and it took time. And then after that, now I'm 34, and I'm like, you know what? I know who I am. I don't <laughs> care anymore, and I love myself. So I think it took that time for me. So right. Jennifer, tell me about yourself. Uh, so it's, um, it's sort of like similar. I... Uh, I was very very insecure about myself when I was younger I'm 26 years old now um, so when I was like about 18 years old uh, that's where my insecurity kicked in the most especially because I had my first daughter so um, it was it was different for me it was different because I thought uh, you know I wasn't pretty anymore um, I also like I was depressed I was really really depressed with myself and I had to learn who I was I no see to you told it. me that you were kind of like a hater for a while I was I was like the biggest hater 
ever like <laughs> and, what, and what, why do you think that is that you're such a hater like you end up hating everyone because i wasn't confident with myself like i was so insecure like i will so I would you hate took, on everybody <laughs> so you took it out on everyone and everyone else on so on you felt do you feel like do you feel like your unhappiness with yourself you start to reflect it on others. You start yeah. to hate on other people. Yeah, like I kind of like I brought so ne so much negativity to people around me because everywhere we went, it was like, ew, look at her. Oh, ew. Yeah, you know, even though like the girls, she's like, ew. Yeah. ew. <laughs> like you know, they would have like cute dresses on and everything. I'll be like, oh, look at her. Like, why would she wear that? And you know, this and that. It was just like always negative always negative comments like i never complimented anyone because that's how i felt about myself and i had to like i had to stop <laughs> so you're trying to find flaws in others because you didn't i didn't have it in me like you know well because all my flaws and everything i feel like everybody saw them and i would point them out more because i would talk about other girls you know and so how did you insecure. become confident now like what took so long uh it took me a long time be or and um because of my girls because i oh, learned your that, daughters yes i was like well i don't want them to be this kind of person that i am being you know Ooh, look at that <laughs> It's like a, uh. <laughs> <laughs> See, I'm, I'm a bad influence. Yeah, he is. I'm like very shy. <laughs> oh, oh, that's right. You said you were shy, but then you like attention. Yeah, I'm we're like, like the opposite. <laughs> we're like, we're confused. Like you're shy, but then you like attention. I love attention, but I'm also shy. <laughs> it goes well together. <laughs> it's, you're adorable. I adore you. <laughs> oh, thank you. Me too. I agree a lot. So, so after you have your daughters, yeah. you start to have confidence in yourself. Yeah. Uh, it, after, I mean, first you said you're insecure because you had your first child. Yes. And then your third and second daughter came out. Then they kind of help bring out a different yeah, side of they, you. Yeah, they helped me realize that I should stop being a bitch. Oh! So somebody call, did somebody call you out? Uh, no, that's the thing. Nobody will. Well, you know what? The only real person was my hubby. He he, he called you he out. He would call me like, "Oh, you're such a hater. Why are you always hating?" And I'm like, you know what? You're right. Like I'm always hating. So I had to like pet talk. I had to like talk to myself and be like, "You need to stop being this person. You need to like, you know, get your shit together." Here, use this hand so they can see what I'm doing on oh, this side. Yes. <laughs> hey, you know what I like though is that you admit it. Most people can't admit it. I think admitting that you're insecure and that you are a hater, I think that's owning who you are. And that's, yeah. the, that's the first step to building confidence is owning it. You have to own it before, before anything else. Yeah, before you have to accept it. And you have to accept who you are before you could even like start um, kind of like, you know, processing everything and stop being who you were. Like, well, I think I think that's why now with this hair color, it's a part of how you start having your confidence. Like ever since we did your hair, I feel like your confident level changed. You start to become very like, um, you start to become more confident who you are. Became more proud. Yeah. And I think that's what it was. I think that you were a hater before your hair color. <laughs> but you know, but that, no, no, that's the thing. I think that. When you did something for yourself, you changed your hair color, you felt more confident in yourself. So, I did. My confidence level did go up more. So, oh my gosh! Is that the fire alarm? <gasps> Is that alarm? a fire? Are we in trouble? Oh my god! Do we have to run? <laughs> oh my god, we have to leave! In the middle of everything! That's because you're getting so hot! Oh my gosh. Okay, no, 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 no. The fire alarm is on. We gotta have a twerk party. Uh, we gotta I have a twerk, twerk party. Twerk, 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 twerk. Oh yeah, shake it, shake it. Twerk party with the fire alarm. <laughs> but we have to, it's getting hot in here. Yeah. So pick a fire that cup. fire one. No, no, we're gonna keep doing hair. Is we don't, this real? <laughs> I don't even know. There's a fire alarm going up, but we don't care. Ain't nobody oh, gonna oh, die. Ooh, the fireman could come and save us. Oh, the fireman! Yes. <laughs> I'm gonna play the fireman. <laughs> Let me get my hose out. Do Let it. me get my hose out. <laughs> oh, we'll be here doing hair while they come and save us. Yeah, we'll be fine. <laughs> I don't care. Yeah, but girls, you need to work it. You need to talk to yourselves and realize who you are and accept who you are. I don't like to say the word accept. 
Ooh. I like to say embrace who you are. Because accepting yeah. is like, oh, I guess... I no. guess this is me. I guess this is, <laughs> this is who I am. I might as well just accept it. Oh, I don't no. like the word accept. I like, okay. to, I like to say embrace. Okay. Embrace who I you like are. That. I love you like it. that? Can I, you say I that? Love it. I love You need to embrace yourself. Embrace. I embrace myself. Mm -hmm. Embrace uh, who yes. you are. Embrace yourself. Yes. So we're definitely starving. So we're at a restaurant eating with Jennifer. <laughs> so turn on Jennifer. Okay, so what I'm wanting to do is create like a northern lights an aurora effect so you can see bands of neon green kind of like shattered in there i kept the shadow root on top blurring into the, these cool tones then we have these shadow ends which is going to be a lot of fun very different i'm very excited about it jennifer how do you feel i'm excited you're just hungry i'm hungry i'm starving <laughs> i'm starving too i mean where is the person helping us there's nobody at the nobody register at service. what happened to the service i mean like have you noticed that we've waited for like eight minutes eight minutes we're like hello we're about to be sent yeah where's the service wait is he is he gonna be the guy taking care are you are you gonna take care of us we're starving what we're starving Will you be on my camera? Sure, why not? Look at this hot guy. Oh my god, so Look, is he hot? Show him your biceps. No! Sh oh. Oh He's shy. He's shy. It's okay. Oh my gosh, guys. This is gonna look epic. And we're just hungry waiting for our food. But it's already glowing. Look at that. Woohoo! It's glowing, girl. Oh my gosh, the food finally came yes. out. Yes! Oh, you got shrimp. We were getting grumpy. You were getting grumpy. <laughs> <laughs> it looks so good. I'm so excited. Okay, so we're gonna eat while well, the color process. Yes. I don't care about y'all, but yeah. yes, I do. I care about all the hair besties. <laughs> I'll let you eat it. Mm, look at that. Look at that. Mm -mm -mm. Hello. Mm -hmm. So we are finally done with Jenny's hair. Take a look. Yeah. I love it. It's very different, and I know that you like everything really bright usually because you like attention. I love attention. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know what to choose. I mean, we have the first look that we did on you that was like neon, rainbow, unicorn hair. Right. Then we had the second look, which was smoked out, and you told it me it was you... smoky, minty. It, it was fun, but, but you I didn't thought... like that. You said you didn't. You wanted more brighter. I wanted more, yes. So when you came back the third time, I was like, let's make it really bright. Yes. So I made it super, super bright. And today I kind of fused the two together. I was like, let's do calm and then let's do, do this. loud yeah. all at the same time. Um, I don't know. I think it's pretty cool. I wanted to mimic like the northern lights. You know, mm -hmm. have like the Aurora, band, yes. the aurora, the band of light, more centered towards the face, surrounding the face, in through here. So you can see it kind of like just surrounding the face and kind of coming down through the ends through here. I love it. It's different. It's fun. Yes? I love it. Do you it. feel yes. like this will give you enough attention? <laughs> <laughs> yes, I feel like I'm going to get stopped on the street. Yes! <laughs> so the take home message of the day is to love, love yourself. yourself. Yes! And What's the other one? And spoil yourself. Yeah, yeah. yeah. And be happy. Be happy, cause be happy. When, cause when you're happy, everyone's happy. everyone's happy. So, like you told me, when you were a hater, you were hating on everyone. Yes, <laughs> yes. and I was like so negative towards everything. And because you need to spoil yourself. Once you love yourself, you start to realize everything is okay, right? Everything is awesome. Okay. <laughs> Be a lover, thumbs up, subscribe, leave comments below, tell us which one you like. Yes. Her first look the with the rainbow unicorn, the second smoky look, the third the look, bright. the bright one, or, <laughs> or this one. We don't know. Mom. Yeah, it's both together. It's both, yes. yeah. Yeah. So you guys pick because we don't know. Love you much. Bye-bye. All right, guys. So we are finally done. And the reason why I'm outside the sun is because when I was inside, I felt like everything looks blue. Her hair looks blue and you don't see all the dimension. So I went outside and the color looks completely different, as you can see. And especially with direct sunlight, you can see the dimension and the, like, the glow of her hair. So uh, we're going to go inside now. So I want you guys to see the difference, what lighting makes. So uh, this is really cool because it's like, whoa, you get to see your hair here, then you get to see your hair inside. So I'll insert the inside clip of her hair right now, boom, and then you can see it in, con in contrast. It's just insane and crazy just to put the two together. I personally prefer in direct sunlight because you get to see that berry type of tone, but you know, up to you guys. I like it both. Now we're going to go inside now.